So in this video, I'll be showing you how to calculate the operating income. So please watch the previous video. If you haven't watched it, we'll just be continuing from there, but not the information. It will not be the same. So you're given your sales already and your sales is 860,000. And then when you get your sales, you have to list your cost of sales. Okay, the cost of your goods sold, and in this case, it's five hundred thousand. So, when you get that amount, you will get your gross profit. Okay, and your gross profit is three hundred and sixty thousand. Okay, so now to get your operating expenses, so as soon as you get your gross profit, you will always have to deduct your operating expenses. Okay, so normally we will call it your SGA, which is your selling, general, and administrative expenses. So then you have your sales and marketing. Okay, which is your 5000 and then you have your salaries and wages. Which is 15,000. And then we have your administrative expenses. Admin, I'll just put your admin expenses, which is your 6,000. But in your exams, please write the whole thing, write it fully. So all of these, all of these, this is your SGA, okay? And then if we add all of that together, we have your 5,000 plus your 15,000 is a 20,000 plus 6,000 is your 26. So after your gross profit, you are going to less your operating expenses, which is your 26,000, okay? Which is the total of all this okay is your 26,000 and then you will get your operating income and your operating income is your gross profit that you got which is your 360,000 minus your 26,000 and that is 334,000 and i hope this helps so it's very simple very easy and don't forget to subscribe and watch the previous video so you understand the meaning behind getting a gross profit and how to calculate your cost of goods sold which is super important bye